Okay, this is now the, tw the five minute tarot for the 28th of July 2017. <clears throat> and today, uh, one card. Okay, so in English, we have the word harmony. And you probably all know the word harmony. But if there isn't harmony, we say there's disharmony, right? D-I-S at the beginning of the word. And then we've also got unity. And if there isn't unity, there is disunity. So it's like the opposite of. So the word, di the prefix D-I-S can mean un or not or the opposite of. Okay, that, that's point one. Point two is, imagine a wooden box and if there's a lid on it, you don't know what's in the box because you can't see through the wood. But if you remove the lid, if you take off the cover, you discover the opposite of cover. So you now see what's in, you can see what's in the box. And this relates to the judgment card. And I'm thinking often with judgment, we can think, okay, it represents freedom and new beginnings in, in, in its own way because you were trapped, you were inside the coffin, or you were in a, a, a situation where you were confined and restricted and you couldn't move that much, or you were unable to make the progress that you wanted, a situation like that. But then the angel blows the trumpet, the horn, you're inspired and you're, you're given a new freedom. But if we think of the idea of the, the lid of the coffin, the cover of the coffin being removed, you discover. And so the, 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 the judgment card can be about freedom, but it can also be about the importance of discovering and seeing what's there, seeing what was hidden or what was invisible or what was not noticed, but paying attention and looking around and un for the questioner to understand that maybe in the past you couldn't see it or you didn't see it. And let's say the, the, card, the, the judgment card represents a present position. Now you can see. Now you've got greater vision, broader vision. Now you're going to be able to identify what was hidden or what was invisible or what was unseen. And it's up to you, the questioner, to discover what maybe what's going on, or the under, to discover the underlying reasons for things. So if the reader can get the questioner to understand that now is a time of discovery, and discovery meaning removing the cover and seeing what's there, or what was there but you couldn't see it. And I was thinking of the Beatles again. John Lennon, the, 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 the first movie they made was A Hard Day's Night, and then they made a second one called Help. And I think it was a movie, but it was certainly an album called Help. And um, the, 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 the words are, um, when I was young and so much younger than today, I never needed anybody's help in any way. But now these days have gone, I feel so insecure, um, something blah, blah, blah. Okay, so the thing is about help. Help, I, I need somebody's help, not just anybody help. You know, I need someone's help. It's what they sing. But the thing is, some years after the album came out or the song came out, John Lennon was interviewed and he said when he wrote the song, he needed help, right? He was crying out for help because he was unhappy and discontented, whatever he was. But he said that people just thought it was a song and they didn't understand or appreciate that actually he was asking for help. And maybe that's what's going on with the judgment card. You discover and you see what's below the surface. So maybe with the, dis with the judgment card, the questioner can understand that there's what appears to be going on. And then there's also what's really going on below the surface. And if the questioner looks to understand what's going on below the surface, they're going to discover a lot. They're going to understand a lot. They're going to be in a stronger position to know what to do because they've got a bigger understanding, a better understanding of what's actually going on. So they're not, not going to make mistakes the way they would have made mistakes when things were unclear or when they were uncovered or when they were covered rather and inside the box. That was more like a five minute tarot. 
Um, so thank you for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye.